it's a lean, mean, yellow off-roading machine, and it can be yours for less than fifteen pounds. Unfortunately, you can't actually drive it, but I mean, it's yellow. This set comes depicting the famous British off-roader, the Land Rover Discovery Classic, and was released June 2023, containing a nice 149 pieces and retails for around £13.49. Personally, I was after the other Land Rover Lego set, but couldn't justify the greater cost, as much as it does look freaking insane. This set being available at this price point is an ideal for those on a budget like myself, because I do buy too much Lego. And furthermore, this set is also geared towards a younger target audience, meaning it should be easier to build this incredible machine. Taking a look at the box art, we see the little yellow Land Rover in all of its glory with a nice foresty mountain backdrop. The box itself is yellow to denote that this is a creator set and turn the box around to look at the back. Gives us a close look at the singular minifigure included in this set as well as showing off the fact you can take the roof off the vehicle itself. This can be to put other minifigures in or accessories in the vehicle and it also has an additional image of its bigger greener cousin above that image there as well. Hey you, yes you, the awesome person watching this video. Do you like Lego and want more videos like this? Then feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and press that bell icon so you get notified when I release a new video. Opening the box we get three bags, two for the bigger parts and one for the smaller intricate parts. Instructions for the set as well as one sticker that's used for the grill at the front. Building this set was really easy. There were no complicated build techniques used so it made for a really nice relaxing building experience. Honestly, I wish all builds were this easy and had only one sticker to put on. So now that we build the set, we can dive in and see how it looks. Overall, I feel like the set manages to capture the shape of the actual Land Rover very well within this six wide design. At this size, Lego has to take some liberties with some of the design cues, so the body fold along the side isn't there, and the build techniques used are basic, but that's to be expected at this price point. The roof comes off nicely and allows you to put minifigures and or accessories in the vehicle and you're also able to put some accessories on top of the vehicle like the snowboards I've put on top of them. As for the minifigures in this set, we get one which is this adventurous redhead with a love for pineapples apparently and features an overall design of a woman who likes to adventure with a lovely pineapple shirt and beige bottoms with green glasses and ginger hair which is nicely moulded. The head for this minifigure features two facial expressions for those times you're really happy and those times you're feeling a bit mischievous and accidentally buy more Lego. Finally, what do I think of this model? If you're on a budget like myself and don't have £200 to spend on the other Land Rover model, or you have a child that's after the Land Rover model but aren't big on complicated builds, then this set is ideal for you. I honestly absolutely adore this set as I'm a massive fan of cars myself and this model fits nicely on my desk. I think my only criticism with this set is I kind of wish it was a different colour but the yellow doesn't look too bad and to be fair you could stick some stickers on and you've got a nice mountain search and rescue vehicle if you so desire. So what do you guys think? As always I'll be answering comments for a few hours after this video has gone live. Which bigger set do you want to see in a smaller form? Anyway, take care guys and I'll see you in the next video.